Hey guys, if you haven't watched part one of our answering the call video, we encourage you to do so as it lays the foundation for this video. But if you're all caught up, let's continue. Ephesians chapter two, verses eight through 10 says, for by grace are you saved through faith. In that, not of yourselves, it is the gift of God. Not of works, lest any man should boast. For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus unto good works, which God hath before ordained that we should walk in them. As you may already know, responding to God's call isn't about our achievements, but it's about walking in obedience to his will. We're saved by grace and out of gratitude we serve. In the first video, we highlighted patience, waiting on God as you pray, study, and serve. In this video, we'd like to focus on humility. Serving isn't about recognition, but it's about following Christ's example with a humble heart. For example, when we first moved to Nashville, Tennessee, we served in small, unseen ways. One of the ways we served was through vacuuming the church we attended, not looking for recognition, but doing it privately as an act of service to the Lord. Over time, we were invited to lead worship, but our motivation remained the same, to honor God. Serving in humility means recognizing that all we do is for His glory. So how do you nurture this spirit? Start with daily prayer, not just asking, but listening to God. Join a Bible study to grow in fellowship and deepen your understanding of Scripture. As mentioned in the first video, look for ways to serve in your church or community, and if possible, seek a mentor to help you grow spiritually. Learning more about the communities you hope to serve is also crucial. Approach people with empathy, understanding their needs rather than imposing your ideas. In your personal life, view worship as a lifestyle, not just something we do on Sunday mornings. More on that to come as well. Trust that as you wait with patience and practice humility, God is shaping you for His purpose in guiding your path. We hope this video was encouraging as you seek to answer God's call. Stay posted for part three, where we'll dive deeper. But until next time, God bless.